one more lap and we will be going of the uh, the small loop rolling up so pole position Pete Gillett on the outside Alexander Lamin on the second row Mark Turner in his black and white garb on the outside James Edwards two to qualify Oh, get that hole shot. Pete Gillett gets a good start, but that counts for nothing when you go into this gale up towards, towards Billy's blind. Lamin in his slipstream. Turner's got ahead, but I think John Gooch might have a run up the inside into the long right-hander. He's secured fourth place. David Storey goes fifth. And Lamin is already looking for the lead. These two should hopefully work together to pull clear, but I don't think they're going to. I think Pete Gillett wants to lead and Alex Amin wants to be by. And that's put Mark Turner into third place and on Alex's bumper. Gooch in fourth. There's contact off the last corner and it's side by side for the lead. And I think Lamin might have led that lap down the inside into turn one. Oh, Turner sideways and spins out. Too ambitious. Too early, perhaps. Perhaps not. Who knows? Gooch to the inside of Gillett. Oh, there's more contact, and Gillett is out, and that's going to be a penalty for Gooch, I fear. So Lamin is clear. Story now moves into second place. And, and I suspect Alex Lamin will be uh, already thinking about the air final. He's got a useful lead. Townsley looking to the inside, can't get it done. So Gillett leads, oh sorry, Lamin leads by the best part of one second, nine tenths of a second. Ahead, David Storey. There's Storey behind. 41 is James Edwards in third place. And third doesn't get you in the air final. Dressed in red, I suspect that's Scott Kelman. Head of Darren Townsley and John Gooch. Townsley looks to the inside, or is he covering off Gooch? I think he's covering off Gooch there. Gooch looks to the inside, again, can't get it done. So Townsley has moved ahead of Kelman. So there's Lamin. Story. James Edwards, Darren Townsley, Gooch down the inside of Kelman, and a chance for Paul Williams to get onto the bumper of Scott Kelman. Jonathan McLeod. Trying to run down Jordan Salter.
David Sterling trying to get onto the bumper of Andrew Clark. Going down into turn one, can't get it done. Meanwhile, Paul Williams has picked off Scott Kelman. So Williams moves up to sixth. Could he run his way into the back of the year final? Big ask, big ask. Seven minutes left of this 12-minute B final. Forty-two nine for Paul Williams on that last lap. He needs to run his way in. He's going to have to speed up. So race leader Alex Lavin miles away from the apex there. Puts David Story onto his bumper, pretty much. Well, a cart length. Closing in on the brakes in the last corner. Chance for Story. Big, big breeze blows through and it puts him straight on the bumper in the slipstream. So we have a race for the lead. And there's the battle for second between Edwards and Townsley. John Gooch behind. And then Paul Williams, that's a butt marker. Sorry to say. Townsley pulls out from the slipstream. And Story took a look himself at the lead there. And he's gone through on the exit of turn one. So David Story leads. Two to qualify. That wouldn't be such a hard shit for Alex Lamin. They're coming up on Pete Gillett. I'm trying to remember who, who was responsible for Pete's demise. And I'm sure he'll get out of the way and not uh, cause any problem. Empty track, that's not very sexy, is it? So we've got uh, a two-way battle for the lead. Pete Gillett holding up David Storey. Alex Lamin closes back in. We've got a three-way dice for third place. James Edwards, Darren Townsley, John Gooch. Storey has safely navigated Gillett. Lambing back on his bumper. This could all come back together for the finish here. We have to ignore Pete Gillett because he's out of this one. And he's made it awkward for James Edwards. That won't win him any friends. So Edwards finally gets by Pete Gillett. And if he's been shown a blue flag. Townsley goes straight down the inside in the hairpin and Gooch will follow through, I think. And we effectively, just to say, have a four, maybe five, weird dice for two qualifying spots on the back of the uh, air final. With two minutes, 45 seconds left. It's David Storey leading Alex Lamin. Two to qualify. James Edwards, Darren Townsley. Pete Gillett is a lap down. John Gooch. 
runs in fifth. And it's coming back together as Townsley goes for third place. Can he get it done? And he gets it done fairly cleanly. Oh, he leaves the door open for James Edwards to come back through. And that has probably ruined any chance that they had of qualifying. David Storey and Alex Lamin are released. And I'm afraid these three, three drivers are fighting over the scraps from the table. Just racing for pride unless they can get it together. Gooch to the inside of Townsley, not there. Behind sixth place is still Paul Williams. Jordan Salter, I think that is, now in seventh. With Scott Kelman in eighth. One minute left of this B final. We'll pick them as they come out of the yeses. It's David Storey leading. And it's looking comfortable now. He's got half a dozen cart lengths on Alex Lamin, who in turn has got four or five cart lengths on James Edwards. Yeah. Well, that means it's still not over. It was half a second, the gap on the last lap between Lamin and, Sol uh, Lamin and Edwards. It's not that now. I think there could be a sting in the tail of this B final. The question is, who for? So Edwards onto the bumper of Alex Lamin, and we are on the last lap of the B final. David Storey is heading to the back of the A final. I think Alex Lamin has just got enough in hand into the horseshoe for the last time. It's going to be a drag race to the line. Edwards takes an easy win, and I think Alex went in quite deep, but he's going to hold on. David Storey wins, Alex Lamin is second. James Edwards finishes third, Darren Townsley, John Gooch was fifth, Paul Williams finishes in sixth, Jordan Salter in seventh, Scott Kelman, Jonathan McLeod, Paul Goddard tenth, David Sterling eleventh, Nick Divers, 12th, Andrew Clark, Mark Turner, Pete Gillett, Craig Rankin is classified as 16th. And we now move on.